Welcome to the Brightsign Player Wireless Module Install Tutorial. First, your work environment should be discharged of any static electricity. Properly ground yourself and discharge any static that's present on your body by touching something metal that's grounded to the earth. Place the Brightsign Player face down on a protective surface to avoid scratching the enclosure. Now remove the four Phillips screws from the back plate. Remove the backplate carefully. XD and XD players have plastic teeth along one side of the backplate. Be careful not to break them. If you have an LS player, as well as removing the backplate, there are two screws on the PCB that must be unscrewed before you can remove it. Next, carefully slide the two plastic side bezels out from each end. Reach through the bezel openings to gently raise the printed circuit board up off the support posts. Shift the PCB towards the side with the green PCB corner cutouts. Lift the opposite end of the PCB out of the enclosure. Inspect the square heat transfer pad. If it's still attached to the aluminium block on the PCB, leave it in place. If it's adhered to the case, leave it in place. If it's out of place or looks like it has become partly unadhered, place it squarely onto the aluminium block. Place the PCB on an electrostatic discharge protective surface. Install the Wi-Fi module as shown at an angle. This is what the connector for the wireless module looks like. Press down and install the retention screw. Bring the antenna wire from the module around the side of the PCB and hold it against the back with minimal slack in the wire. Reinstall the PCB into the enclosure while holding the antenna wire snugly against the back of the PCB. Align the white DC input with the printed word DC inside the purple case. Pass the antenna wire through the bezel opening on the side with the PCB cutouts. Now remove the rubber plug in the bezel for that side and pass the antenna wire connector through the hole in the bezel until it's fully seated. The bezel has a hexagonal feature that the antenna connector will slide into. Secure the antenna connector with the lock washer and nut. Now reinstall the bezel, making sure it's flush with the PCB inputs and outputs. Now install both of the small screws to secure the bezel with the Wi-Fi antenna connector. Using a magnetic screwdriver or a magnetized screwdriver will be helpful, as it's difficult to get these screws installed in the proper position. Do not skip this step. If you drop a screw into the case, be sure to retrieve it as a loose screw will short the board. Next, install the final bezel and ensure that the wire is comfortably inside the case. Carefully reinstall the back plate. Reinstall the four Phillips screws and tighten securely. Finally, install the external antenna at the desired angle. Thank you for watching.